What's up guys? It's your girl Syria and I am back with another video. Today I'm going to talk about my experience in the pit. You may or may not know a little bit about the photographer's pit and that's actually mm, the least uh, glamorous part of a fashion show or fashion week. Maybe it's not the least glamorous. Uh, there's a lot of not so glamorous uh, aspects and that's usually everything outside of the runway but the photographer's pit is something that is very uh, little known about outside of the photography industry itself I've been able to uh, be in the photographer's pit uh, several times in my career and um, I just thought I would tell you guys a little more about it um, so how did I get into uh, fashion shows or fashion photography? I started out as an intern at one of the main uh, fashion video production businesses. I interned with them and then eventually I graduated into a freelancer for them. And so I was attending the shows and uh, doing assistant editing, assistant producing, assistant production production assistants. I wore many hats and I have been in many different positions in fashion and fashion photography and photography in general. So the photographer's pit is a, uh, a different story. When you see a fashion show and the models are walking straight ahead or whatever direction they're walking in, usually it's a straight ahead path um, sometimes it's in a u-shape and they're coming out from backstage the show begins the lights are on the guests are in front row and they're waiting and uh what are they walking towards they're walking towards the photographer's pit actually so they're looking straight ahead and everybody that's in the photographer's pit is taking the photos of each model each look and usually they are hired by uh, magazines and other publications um, online magazines fashion news networks and channels they come from all of these publications and um, usually there's a house photographer and or a house videographer and those are the people that get to be f like right in the center and um they get the best shots. It's a very aggressive and uncomfortable setting, but you grow comfortable um, once you get used to it. It's never gonna be like physically comfortable, but um, when you're just like in the zone and you are there for your purpose and that's it, then there's nothing that can stop you from getting your shots. You have to come early and you gotta get your spot and you can't let anybody take your spot because somebody will take your spot. Everything is fast paced and this is going on, this is going on and um, the, the makeup artist is zipping right past you and the producers are making sure everything is okay and it's just like a lot going on at the same time but I love it. I freaking love it. It's probably something that you have to be like built for or used to. So with these photographers, they're usually in the same place. So even though it can be an aggressive setting, it's also like mad love too, because it's like, you know, we're all here for the same thing. We all do the same thing. I seen you already at like 200 shows before. Hey, how you doing? Whatever, you know, and you might get yelled at in there. It can be crazy, but once the show begins, we are just like crammed together like sardines just trying to get those shots some people got their tripods their monopods somebody's kneecap will be on their shoulder your leg will be on somebody else's thigh and then it's like a game of twister it's crazy usually these photographers have to run to the next show immediately after so with fashion week going on there's like a show after show after show after show and it's so crazy because these shows take maybe a year months of preparation and then that show it just lasts like 15 minutes or less sometimes and then and then that's it Photographers off to the next event, off to the next event, off to the next event. Um, some um, companies or publications probably send a team because sometimes they need to do interviews of the, the special guests in the crowd, maybe the backstage, and then you have to be like in the front 
at the same time so yeah it's very interesting and um, I've included a photo of what the photographer's pit looks like and I just got in there this year for the first time in a couple of years um, because since then I was just doing a lot of like portrait lifestyle my blogging have you ever been in the photographer's pit have you ever heard of the pit is it something that you would ever consider doing do you think you're built for it leave your comments and also don't forget to go to that red button that says subscribe and select it it's your girl syria thanks for tuning in see you next time check out another video daily vlog number 12 was behind the scenes of fashion week and there you can see some of the footage i took at one of the recent uh fashion week shows that i attended you'll get a little bit of an idea check out that video it's linked below